All of a sudden, Smokey ran out, went straight towards Oliver. He didn't know what hit him. Um, I tried to pull Oliver away, um, but he had had such a tight hold on him. Uh, the leash cut my hand from like rope burn, trying to get him off. I was yelling for them to come out and get their dog. Who came? Tracy came out from the garage and then eventually their daughter came out. All right, so let me hear from Ms. Pena. When you came out, what did you see? First, it was my daughter. Your she, daughter came out first. She's the fastest one so, out of us three. <laughs> come up, come up, Speedy. <laughs> so I was, um, Smokey got out, and as soon as he got out, he was peeing on the tree. He who? Uh, Smokey. Smokey was peeing. Yeah, he was peeing on the tree. I ran out. She was yelling at me saying to get your dog on a leash, and she was also cussing at me. Sarah, I had the impression from the pleadings that you arrived on the scene before mom did, yeah. because part of what mom and, what's your name, sir? Ramon. Come on, Ramon, now you've been chomping at the bit. Okay. He thinks he's in yeah. church. Yeah. Part of what I gathered from your papers is that you were sorry about what happened mm -hmm. to Oliver. You even said, you know, I apologized. I apologized. But you got your her, backs yeah. up because you saw the plaintiff yelling at your kid. So what did you see? After they went out, I walked out like seconds after that. So then she just went off saying. What was she saying? Uh, what was know, she saying? Just, but just keep your dog on a leash. <clears throat> you, have, you guys should have your guys' dog on a leash. And Wow, it sounds so horrible. Her little terrier is like being mauled by your yeah. dog. And she's like, ah, keep your dog on a leash. And, Frankly, you know, that's saying nothing bad that's, words. Hey, listen, that, yeah. that's not offensive. Okay. That's not offensive. No, I know. But it was, you know, after that, that was the part where There was, was some profanity yeah. that you heard. Your 13 year old was present and yeah. people got irritated. So how do we disentangle the two dogs? How are the dogs separate? They, they weren't. They, they weren't even going at each other. Well, My, when you came on the scene, they weren't going Smokey at each other. Smokey was peeing on the tree. Her, her dog wasn't barking. Are you suggesting that she's fabricated this incident? I have no idea. I didn't hear about anything until a month later. That night of, she never said, your dog attacked my dog or anything. You don't think she's just out there screaming and yelling at your kid because nothing happened and she was bored. Something happened. She's done that before with another dog that's no longer with us and my older daughter who's 26. Are you, as you stand here in court today, disputing the notion that Smokey attacked Oliver? I am. I don't think she fabricated it. You know why? Because she submitted photographs of little Oliver in the car. I presume coming back from the vet, Oliver's been stitched up in the back. But after the incident, Ms. Leckler, I understand you had a lawyer send the defendants a letter, I correct? I the demand. That letter was from you. And in that letter, you made a demand of over $10,000? $10,000, exactly. Did you send them any vet bills with that letter? I did not. Had you already received medical treatment for Oliver? Yes. So why didn't you send them the bill? I, I, I see that. What I kind of that. sense does that make? There is a video that I'd like to see. It's submitted by you, Ms. Lekla. Mm -hmm. This was the day, day or two after, um, I can't remember exactly, that's um, of him after the surgery. Um, in therapy, he's rehabbing his um, back. Um, you can see the knee and the hip bending outwards. But he, he's probably about 85% recovered now. He still has issues with jumping and running. Okay, thank you. So I'm going to ask you, sir, to have a seat, and I want to speak to Sarah. Sarah, how old are you? I'm 13. Okay. Your position is that you came out first. Yeah. What did you hear? What brought you outside? Um, so I heard like her dog barking and her yelling. Okay. So I immediately went to go open the garage and then I ran Were out. Were you in the garage? Yes, I was. Where was Smokey? Smokey was like going inside and outside of the house and the garage. What were you doing in the garage? Uh, I was helping my mom out with something. So your mom was in the garage with yeah. you? So you both heard the sound? Yeah. I didn't hear, I heard her like yelling. Yelling. So the dog was already outside when you were both still in the garage and she's screaming, your dog needs to be on a leash. So you thought she was just, for the heck of it, just shouting? She always says that. Well, is your dog on a leash when the dog is outside? But we take Come it on. out. Come on, is the yeah. dog on a leash but when, when the dog is outside? Is your no. dog on a leash when the dog is outside? When we're no. taking it, yeah. But because it accidentally got out, so we weren't planning on it, so we didn't have it on a leash. 